to come up on the stage. I don't want to. No, come out. Uh, you know what? It is better for you to come up there. I was joking, but it turned into. No, 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 just because uh, we're crowded up here. It's not because you're. You're not a short <laughs> Just so we can make more room. Amen. And, um,. Want to grab that other thing? See if that makes sense. <coughs> Turn that mic on. Hello.
But that's not the only thing. When you speak, the anointing on you flows to the audience. The people that you're speaking to, they get excited also. So I just want you to know, God said you would be a powerful couple in the things of the Lord, you and your wife. And he said, if you just keep this humbleness and this gentleness and this excitement that you got and be, ex be not accepting of the things that's not holy, do not let anything make you accepting of things that's unholy because he has called you to holiness. He has called your house to holiness. He said, you must be holy. When you teach, you must be holy because he is holy. Say hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. So, Father, right now, God, as we stand before you, in your wonderful presence, and the angels of the Lord that are here, Father Thorne, you need to know there are angels yes. of heaven that have been assigned to you. Yes. As you wait on the Lord, pray as you speak these things, as you give everything to God, these angels will go go before you and do wonderful things. I see angels working in your church services as well. Yes. Not only opening doors, but there's angels, there's multiple angels to work in the church services, touching the people, even the good people there, and different things like that. And Father God, as we stand before you, we thank you for this Lord, the calling that you put with them, yes. your son, who you have shaped and raised up for this day. Yes. We thank you, Lord, for how you have proven him in the fire and tried him, Lord, and that you have uh, given him the rock to stand upon, mm -hmm. even through the winds, even through the fire. And Lord God, as you have called him, he has stood for you. We thank you, Lord, for what you've done. By your mighty leading, by your mighty presence. And Father, yes, we, we thank you for the full release of your anointing right now. Yes. Let's lay hands on him. Yes. Right now, Lord, we don't lay our hands suddenly upon Brother Torrance. We have not laid our hands upon him suddenly, but we lay hands now at the proper time. But this is the time. For you to work your work, Father, and to establish his goings, to preach with all authority, to speak the word, and to not let any man despise even his youth, but that he'll operate in the authority that you have given unto him. Standing for you, Jesus. Lord Jesus Christ, thank you for being his leader, his head that you have placed him in your body and raised him up for this time. That he would go forth, oh God, and glorify you. We thank you, Jesus. Thank you for the word that you put down deep in his heart. Lord, let it be like rivers of living water flowing by your spirit. Hallelujah. Let that river continually flow from heaven. Right from your throne, let the release of the living waters flow. Strong. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. And you're receiving right now this mandate from the Lord. I'm not going to hand you that, that earthly certificate. But God is handing to you something much more valuable right now. The Spirit. God is going to cause you to conquer much, to be a warrior in the spirit, to be fearless, and to keep moving forward. Spiritually. And, and many, many. 
many people will receive the blessings, the healings, the encouragement, the spiritual growth, bringing them into the family. I see outreach as being prayer. I see outreach to the lost, to the lowly, to the homeless, different things in the due time. Outreaches, bringing them in, as well as perfecting the saints of God. It is written in heaven for you. So the certificate of value is the one that's been written already in heaven, and I see the plans written of which we have spoken in Jesus' name. Receive it now. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Jesus. Saints, as he's receiving, let's all just look to the Lord in this moment and just praise him.